Hi, I'm Tom Brent and if you think that you can only practice and better your windsurfing while you're fully planing, full speed and the wind is holding, then I will show you today that by splitting your maneuver in single steps there's always something you can practice and today I want to show you a key point to practice, to improve and to boost your windsurfing. A very important position, a basic skill you should really work on as it is key in so many different maneuvers like the calf jump and wave riding, helicopter tags, numerous freestyle maneuvers is the clue first and clue first switch stance position. Go through the steps on land first, get into clue first position and then switch your feet and start to play. You got various options how to get into clue first position like jibing or helicopter tacking without flipping the cell, only stepping your feet, stay in clue first position and not only stay in clue first position, also try to play around, steer upwind, downwind and get a nice clue first feeling. Probably you haven't mastered your jibes or helicopter takes just yet, that's why you're watching this tutorial in the first place. Um, so place your board on a broad reach and we go for a proper dark jibe sail flip without turning your board into the jibe. Search a nice solid shoulder wide stance. Release your front hand to cross your back hand which is placed really far back and closed the sail just before you let go your front hand cross your hands on the same sail side all the way back to the clue the closer you can get to the clue the better the easier the more neutral the sail will be um, and then you start ducking your sail once your mast hand your front hand is all the way back on the clue as far back as possible as close to the clue as possible and you release your back hand your, your new backhand actually is sort of a pivot point all the way back on your sail. So the mast will swing a little bit forward and to the leeward side. So it will swing to the other side of your body. As soon as you cross your hands, your backhand is back, the sail swung to the new side of your body. You pull the clue as hard as you can into the wind but only with your shoulder, not with your entire body, as you would lose balance very easily. As soon as you pull the sail into the wind, place your new front hand in front of the harness lines and your back hand way behind the harness lines on the boom. As we are aiming for clue first sailing and not a duck jibe, we want clue first sail control. So spread your hands, wide grip, straighten your arms. Done. Now you're sailing clue first, shift your body weight onto your back foot, bend your back knee, straighten your front leg so you can handle the, the sail pressure in clue first position. For a clue first switch stance position, step your front foot back first and then your back foot forward and right onto the center line of your board. A great clue first exercise for your wave rides, for your jibe exits, for all your clue first maneuvers is actually the clue first beat start. As you have to do all the steps you need for a successful wave ride or jibe exit, you have to do them correctly to make your clue first beat start work. 
the Clufus beach start works exactly like the normal beach start, only that you have to place your board way more downwind, almost dead off the wind. Then straighten your front arm, sheet in a bit with your back arm, bring your head in between your shoulders, try to lean as much as you can towards the mast foot and step up. Once you're on the board, keep your back leg bent, front leg straight, your hands are far apart, wide grip, straighten your arms and in the end, to keep full control and keep a nice proper cell position, also include first, place your head onto your front shoulder. Not only is it a lot of fun to practice, you will find out very soon how much all these exercises help your much more advanced maneuvers where clue first sailing, clue first switch stand sailing is essential. Have fun training and playing around and if you like this video feel free to subscribe to like share and comment and see you soon it would be very nice to see you one day at one of our clinics so we can train together learn together and enjoy together <laughs> <laughs>